So we're going live at the old house of Kuantang. So this is built by a Chinese merchant in the late 17th century. A shop house, one of the oldest and most beautiful houses in Hoi An. So it's a one-story house that connects two streets from the front and the back. So let's go in and see. Fabulous wood, wooden beams everywhere. The incense sticks at the door. I, I, I gave you a ticket. Yeah, yeah. I I already came. I already gave you a ticket. Being asked for my ticket again. Because I came in and then I decided to go back to the front and video to show you guys. So I think we have an altar for the ancestors. It's very dark, can't see very well. But it's all, this is 17th century, so built in the 1600s and solid, solid wood. Gorgeous carved furniture. It's a shame it's so dark. A few bits and pieces for sale, of course. And I think there's another picture of an ancestor up there. I wish you could see this beautiful wooden ceiling. Just stunning. I snuck in without a ticket but I did pay. You buy um, one entrance ticket for the whole of the city <clears throat> which is the equivalent of about six US dollars and the ticket lets you walk around the streets and then you can go in to up to five different attractions for that price and then if you want to do more you just buy another ticket but hey six dollars for five different places is pretty amazing <coughs> ah now here you see marked on the door jam the heights of the different floods hey you guys in california i know you've got it bad at the moment but there you can see 1960 something the flood came up to there so I am now standing and this is me reaching my hand up so that's 2000 and something 1960 something 2009 that is about up to my nose 1999 that's about up to my shoulders this house is on two levels, so right now I'm standing at the bottom level and then if I go up to this level, so the 2000 line, that is about level with my chin. That is where the flood water, 2007 it looks like, that's where the flood water came up to. Ah, <sighs> yeah, look at this. So I've just walked through the first part of the house and into the middle and you've got this lovely open courtyard stone floor beautiful wooden screen here and a balcony with tile work up there and this lovely stone all mossy and tile work. This is just an amazing city. It's it's funny, it's so beautiful, there's so much stunning architecture and things to see and it's jam-packed with tourists. Of course it is. It reminds me a lot of Venice in that way. Um, beautiful, beautiful place, jam-packed with tourists. But you can dive off into little side streets and lose a few tourists. 
I mean, we're not standing shoulder to shoulder, so it's not too bad. And now, as you can see, this is a bit of an indentation in this little open courtyard in the centre of it. I'm just going to climb up ah, and get to the other part of the house. So some of these houses, I understand, are still lived in. Some of them are now turned into shops or restaurants. There are just shops and restaurants and cafes jowl by jowl, cheek by jowl. <laughs> um, but it's just stunning architecture. I don't know how I'm going to edit all my photos. <laughs> Beautiful faded paint colours. That's the central courtyard again <clears throat> that we've just walked through. And a little peek into somebody's private room that we shouldn't go into. Ah! I think here we have a picture of Uncle Ho, of course. Uh, looks like stairs going upstairs, but I think that will be private. Wow, wow. This looks like the kitchen. This looks like the kitchen, look at this. It smells like they still cook here. I feel like I'm, I'm intruding, but I know it's it, it's allowed. This is what they do. Yeah, she is. She's making ah, oh, she's making those dumplings. There's um, a type of dumpling here called the white rose. This looks different because the white rose is actually an open one. Um, but we did have some last night and they were delicious. Gosh, the food here is so good. I'm going to get huge. <laughs> Look at this, isn't it beautiful? Upstairs, sleep. Sleep, sleeping. Sleeping, okay. Here is okay? Okay. Looks like I can come through. Xin chào. Is this somebody's home? Oh, it's somebody's chicken. Where's the chicken? Oh my goodness. I feel like I'm intruding, but this is this is what's allowed, this is what's encouraged. Where is the flipping chicken? <laughs> I can hear it. Oh, there it is. Hi, chicken. Hi, chicken. And here's one of the ancient wells. Oh, wow. Look at that. Yeah, Tracy, I have two phrases. Xin chào, which means hello. And I can speak chicken as well. <laughs> and come on, which means thank you. That's about it. So here's the ancient well, it's a bit smelly, not sure I'd want to drink out of it but never mind. Okay, moving away from the chickens now. Oh my lord. This is definitely kitchen. This is so amazing. This, these Look, they're cooking lunch. Look at that. I, I feel like I'm intruding, but they know we're here. They've got a flat screen telly. <laughs> Come on. Okay, moving out. Hi. 
Hi. Gosh, this is stunning. This is just, wow, what a place. It's so, I don't know, I'm, I'm lost for words, aren't I? It's beautiful. Um, it's old. People still live here. It's, yeah, it's living history. It's a bit ramshackle. Um, it's just gorgeous. You can see the wooden, uh, the stone floors all fitted together. So, going to work our way out now, and you've already seen that. Thank you for watching. See y'all later.